Hi tech enthusiasts, welcome to our channel Fast Cabling. So today in this video, join us on a journey where connectivity meets innovation and we will unravel why opting for the long range PoE switch could be the game changer for your network devices and say goodbye to limitation and hello to an extended reliable network. Also, you can visit our website now for cutting-edge solutions and expert insights, discover a world of possibilities, and unlock the future of technology. So choosing the right PoE extension solution is important in ensuring the seamless and reliable operation of networked devices, particularly in scenarios where longer distances are involved. And while a common approach involves using a PoE and VR coupled with a PoE extender, careful consideration must be given to the power budget, especially over extended distances exceeding 100 meters. For instance, now we have 200 meters, so the power loss become a critical factor, potentially leading to inadequate power supply for the connected devices, especially if you're using high power devices. Plus, having a PoE extender in the middle of the link may lead to potential risks. So therefore, we recommend you to use the long-range PoE switch. Now, this switch can help you deal with issue of Ethernet or PoE extension to meet long-distance deployment with easy plug-and-play installation. And also, it gives enhanced system operation stability and maintenance convenience as only one long cable to be run. As you can see, it has a RJ45 PoE port and also gigabit RJ45 Ethernet uplink port. But keep in mind, only port 1 to 4 can support long-distance PoE transmission up to 800 meters. And it is compatible with IEEE A02.3 AF and AT standard and support 30 watts maximum output power per port. And no additional AC outlet is required near the connected PD. So today, I'm going to show you the two ways that we can use this long-range PoE switch to connect with devices. First, we're going to demonstrate the 200 meters connection with the PDZ camera. Remember the previous typical approach that we show you, but using the PoE extender, this time we don't even need the extender. All we need is plug in the Ethernet cable to connect with the long range PoE switch and connect with the PDZ camera. So for the second connection, we are going to achieve up to 500 meters distance by using the long range PoE switch and a PoE extender. So without saying, let's do the first connection first. Here we have the PoE and VR. I'm going to use an Ethernet cable to connect it with our long range PoE switch. Then I'm going to use an Ethernet cable to plug in the long range PoE switch. Here we have a 100 meters. Remember the previous one, we are only using the previous setup. And I'm going to use a coupler to join them together. This is just a simple coupler. So now we can achieve 200 meters in total. Here we go, the second row of Ethernet cable. I'm going to connect it with the PDZ camera. Just give it a second. Now as you can see, it's receiving both power and data. And let's do the second method first and then we'll show you the video feed on the monitor. For the second connection, we are going to use a bullet camera. First, we'll need to connect it with a PoE extender. The reason why we need a PoE extender over here is because this is a very long distance, which is up to 500 meters. However, the bullet camera itself cannot return back the PoE signal. That's why we'll need to add a PoE extender. So when the switch send the PoE signal over here, and it will send it back to achieve the power handshaking. I'm going to take it out, connect it 
with the PUE extender. Actually, it has a waterproof neck and gland. I didn't put it in since I want to plug it in faster, but make sure you use a wrench to fasten them so they can achieve waterproof IP67 rating. And I'm going to use the ethernet cable to connect with the extender. Coming all the way here, since we don't have a big roll of 500 meters ethernet cable, so again, I'm going to use the coupler to join the 200 meters and the 300 meters ethernet cable together. This is a simple coupler, so we have 500 meters now. Coming over here, remember port number one to four are the long range port. So let's plug it into port number two here and give it a little bit of time for the video feed to show up on the monitor. As you can see, we can see two cameras is already, are already displaying and I'm going to go over there to wave my hand so you can see this is a live video. In conclusion, the benefits of utilizing a long-range PoE switch for a network extension are transformative. With an extended reach that transcends traditional limitation, this innovative solution ensures reliable connectivity, flexibility, and scalability for your network infrastructure. Not only overcomes distant constraint, but also provides a robust and cost-effective approach to powering and connecting devices. And if you're ready to revolutionize your network, please subscribe to our channel, Fast Cabling, for more in-depth tech insights. And also stay ahead in the ever-evolving world of technology. So don't miss out on the latest advancement. Subscribe now for a tech-savvy future. And thank you very much for joining us. And I'll see you in the next video.